I'm recording this video right now um, more than I am doing any chatting. I am just simply um, trying to get a hold of Harley Davidson and hopefully they won't take my bike from me because it's been really hard here recently, uh, not getting enough hours, uh, spending too much money on computer crap, and I basically I I messed up. I made a mistake many times over many different mistakes, and I need to try to fix it, try to save my Harley. I am looking for getting uh, a, a a deal, I'm trying to, but you know they're they're stuck in computers. They literally don't know. They they literally don't know. Um, what they're doing all they do is read off a screen because they get paid 15 bucks an hour or something so this is my 2018 harley davidson um this is after my modifications the 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 stuff you can see like um the back bag there is you know a thousand bucks this backrest here was like 150 the handlebar kit was another 600 or so the the windshield was another 250 or so the the levers were another 30 to 40 these were about 150 this thing was about 400 dollars these were 200 these wind deflectors the mufflers are another than 400 dollars and the tires were another 400 dollars and I added those to it. And then I also have a, this is what it looked like when it was stock. I also had another, um, I put a cell phone holder here and a windshield bag inside here too, which adds another 150. And, um, no kitty, I'm busy, please. I love you. I have a cat, then he wants to be in on this. But not right now. Anyway, that I I'm gonna have to edit this. That's why I went and did it on Twitch so I can I can do this um with all my layouts. I don't know how to do it offline and still get my you know, I I I'm really having a hard time learning. So there's my exhaust and stuff you can see there. But I have put this time on here just in case somebody complains they can't see that time and date. All right, so what the hell? No. I'll just go through it quick. All right, I'm coming back. So now I have this, this is being recorded. And then I'll go on live later, maybe, I know I can't, I have to work at five in the morning. Henry, please. Hi. All right, go on now, please. I'll play, I'll, I'll sit with you later. All right, so right. now we're dealing with Eagle Mark Bank, Harley Davidson Financial Services. They're owned by Harley Davidson. Okay, there's there's no separation in them. Damn it.
Okay, this is who we're dealing with here. We're dealing with Harley Davidson, Harley Davidson Financial Services. Damn it. Um, their bills also say Eagle Mark Bank on them. Damn it. All right, I'm, what I'm trying to do is, is, uh, what the hell is wrong with my screen? Or is that the way they they painted the picture? Looks like my screen's going bad. Fuck, it sucks, it's brand new. What's on it? Did I sneeze on it? I don't understand. Anyway. They're not showing it. Nope, it's on my screen, all right. Is there a screen protector on there? Nope. All right, well, that's as much as we're going to get off of this. Okay. So this is who we're dealing with. And that's what we got there. So, going back here. Mm, that was four sixteen. Wait. April 22nd at 1515. I didn't even know I got this one. Oh well. All right, I'm going to have to get this started before. For quality issue. My name is Des. Can I please get the full social or the full account number to access your account?
location. Okay, uh, due to the status of the account, based on based on what the computer screen in front of you is saying, right? I'm sorry? You're just reading the computer screen. How can I help you all today, sir? Well, I, I need to tell you, um, first of all, that uh, this is being recorded, and I am intending on suing your company. And I need you to understand something very important. I am a U.S. Army combat veteran of foreign wars with autism. Ex excuse me? Yes, sir. I'm seeing that you're going in and out, so I can't really hear anything that you're saying. Yeah, you didn't have a problem hearing a few minutes ago at the same distance. I'm going to do this again. I intend on suing your company if you take my motorcycle. A lawsuit is pending, therefore, you can't do anything by law. Second of all, I need you to understand some things very important. First of all, this is being recorded. I am a U.S. Army combat veteran of foreign wars with autism, ADHD, anxiety, and depression due to PTSD. The motorcycle is my therapy, it stabilizes my life, and is medically necessary for my safety and the safety of others. Charging higher interest rates, especially on a large loan for a vehicle, is unethical and illegal by federal and state standards of business practices. I am an internet influencer. The public will be very unhappy to learn how you adversely affected a veteran with PTSD, who was unable to understand the monetary consequences of a high dollar or high interest loan, considering all the necessary and overbearing service fees that made it even more difficult as the, they only cause more hardship. Consider that you have already received in excess of $24,000, which does exceed the original debt. The motorcycle is mine. I am willing to pay you and make an agreement. Otherwise, we have to move forward with this. Um, I'll give an additional 24 months at $500 a month to settle this and no more. That's $12,000 pure profit for your company. Now, your company deserves, it's more than your company deserves since its practices unethical and harmful business practices. Now, if you're willing to take that deal, I can pay $500 today and we'll start that. If you're not, then you can bring it up to your supervisor, their supervisor, and your legal department, and that's all there is. Either make the choice, allow my offer of 24 more months at $500 to settle it, or move it on up to the next person who can actually do something for you, for me. So yes, sir, if you are wanting to, you know, negotiate in regards to a payment here, um, our hire selections department is open tomorrow at 8 a.m. If you're wanting to go over that information with them. Here, this is just the collections department. Um, it's not much that I'd be able to do. Um, if you can give us a call back at 8, they'd be able to go over that with you and see if that's something they were wanting to do. I have no control here in this department in regards to repossession or anything of that nature. I, I understand that. That's why I went ahead and read that statement so that that recording can be given to them and they can hear it themselves and then respond accordingly. I'm not going to... Well, gonna... that's, um, that's fine, sir. Um, again, um, I'm not sure if they would you know, be able to hear this here. This is the collections department. If you want to call in and then you know read that information to them again tomorrow, that'd be great. Okay. All right. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Bye bye. Well, there it is. And believe me, anybody out there that's listening, do whatever you can. Do not sign a note with any fucking company for more than 4%. As a matter of fact, don't ever lease a vehicle. That, that's another no, no doing. Never, ever lease a vehicle. You're better off just paying cash for whatever you can get. If you can't pay cash, just... fuck, I'm shaking. So... 
that's all I have right now. If anybody, any, I have to, I have to go. I have to be. I switching. I'm switching schedules, so I have to go get. Um, I have to go get some food for the week and um, go shopping and get that taken care of. It's snowing outside right now, and um, I get to go cry a little bit and. Well, hopefully people will see this. I should have put it on my other channels too. Um, if you would be so kind to help me out. Or contact one of these philanthropists who send them my way or something. I'd 